meter is used. Unlike the pocket devices, this meter charges itself by its own self-contained batteries. Here's another survey meter. This chamber collects the ions produced by gamma radiation, which is the most penetrating kind. But this, a thin window ion chamber, may be used to detect alpha and beta as well as gamma radiation. Gamma rays, which are the most likely to affect personnel because of their high penetrating ability, pass through the case of the instrument with ease. But beta particles cannot enter. And neither can alpha particles, the least penetrating of the three kinds of radiation. But when a knob on the chamber is turned, opening a slide on its underside, both beta and gamma are admitted, but not alpha. That's solved by turning a second knob, opening another slide. Now it is possible to read alpha as well as beta and gamma radiation. The proportional counter, which has a greater charging voltage than an ion chamber, will count alpha particles in the presence of a strong beta-gamma background. To appreciate its selectivity, think of an orchestra conductor whose trained ears are attuned.